Lift itself works on a principle by uh, sucking in gravel and water at the same time. You want to have about 10% uh, water, or excuse me, 10% material, 90% water coming in through the suction hose. And as it travels up, it hits the flare of the sluice box and it disperses, it kind of widens out to the width of the sluice box. And as it goes across the rifles, it it's like a turbulent effect, and the gold is heavier than the other material, the gold is real heavy, and that gets caught underneath those rifles, and the rest of the material just keeps on going out the tail end of the dredge. Um, also, you want to make sure that when you're dredging that you have your, your tailings pile doesn't build up to go higher than the dredge box. That's actually why we have it set up in the rapids like we do here, it's kind of unusual for us. Just because it's kind of shallow, and we wanted we, it's kind of shallow here. We wanted the material to go down the stream.